to talk about this thing called coaching. We're going to get your feedback on this a little bit later because last yesterday and last night I was talking to a bunch of people outside and I've done this in other group meetings as well when we've facilitated things like this. We said, you know, if coaching is happening in your organization, what would you see? And it was, and, and the various responses were, well, we'd see the, the manager and the sales rep collaborating on the pipeline. We'd see the manager and the sales rep talking about deals. We'd see the manager and the sales rep would be all working together to help develop the salesperson's goals and be more important. Every single one of them, there are various responses, but all of them had one thing in common. And that was, it was all about the conversation between the manager and the salesperson. How do we plan for coaching? Do we capture those coaching moments, so those moments in time on the fly, or do we have the formal coaching session? Do we, are our coaching sessions short, or as Left mentioned this morning, are they more in depth? Uh, but it's all about that conversation, and how can we get better outcomes from that conversation for the salesperson and for the manager. And if it's not the salesperson, maybe it's the sales assistant, or well, we'll just call it salesperson for the sake of today. But if that's the case, then why is sales coaching not happening to the degree that we want to see it in every other organization? And we see that there are two other conversations that are just as critical as this. We have a, a, a gentleman in my neighborhood who's the owner of a lawn landscaping company. It's his third business, and he's looking to grow this business, and it's going to, he wants to grow it to be about a $9 million business, and he wants to sell it. And at the moment, it's about a $1 million mark, and he's, he's grown it pretty successfully in a period of about two years, but it's plateaued off for the last four years, and he can't seem to see grow it above $1 million. Every one of these other two organizations previously that he led, they've reached a million dollars as well. And Dimmer grew beyond that. And at, a, at a, a neighborhood Halloween function last year, last Halloween, over a couple of ciders, we were talking about his business, and he mentioned, and he, he opened up to me and he said, you know, I just can't see myself as anything more than the owner and manager and leader of a $1 million business. Is that going to affect the decisions he makes? Is that going to affect how he talks and coaches his people? Is that going to affect how he talks and coaches his customers? Is that going to affect the opportunities that he not only misses out on, he doesn't even notice? The second co coaching conversation, which is the most overlooked one, is the conversation that the coach has with themselves. Do they have an internal view? What's their attitude towards coaching? Uh, building belief in their abilities, we took a vote earlier and we had unanimous agreement that the attitudinal aspect of selling, this, the, the, the achievement drive, the self-belief in their abilities is what differentiates your excellent sales performance from your average sales performance. I ask you the question, could that be true of your managers as well? So if we're looking to develop coaching, the critical aspect is, are these two conversations aligned? Are they congruent, or is one competing against the other? There was a third conversation, too, and that's the conversation that the manager has with her coach, with his coach, or with their greater organization. So many managers, and we're working with an organization now that has uh, over 1,100 managers, and one of the co consistent things that we hear in this financial services firm is the metrics that those sales managers are being measured on conflict with the coaching that they're trying to do with their people, and the managers are caught in the middle. So are they getting support from their manager and from the organization?